Hello there. Welcome back to Bucks County Beer Reviews. I got my picnic table out of the shed because the weather's getting nice. I can finally do some beer reviews out here. I hope to do a few taste challenges out here on this table. As you can see. I keep this picnic table in the shed all winter. Keep it from falling apart. And as you can see, Today, I have a Jamaican Red Stripe. That's what we're going to be looking at. So, Red Stripe is brewed by a brewery called Desnos and Geds. Desnos and Geddes, something like that. It's 4.7% ABV. Uh, I got that from Untapped. I want to see if it says it on the bottle. Yes, it does. And according to Untapped, it has 23 IBUs. And this beer was introduced in 1928. Uh, <clears throat> it's also brewed in the Netherlands by Heineken. I'm assuming this is a Heineken brand. On Untapped, it gets a 310 with 221,000 ratings. A little history on Jamaica. Uh, in 1962, Jamaica gained independence from Britain. In 1965, this stubby bottle was introduced. 2003, they won a gold medal. 2005 was the first time Red Stripe more was exported from Jamaica than was consumed in Jamaica. All right, that's enough of the history. Let's get this open and see what it looks like. That's the bottle. It's got the red stripe on the cap. Try not to shake the table too much. It'll make the camera get all jittery. All right. This is a plastic picnic table with metal legs. It serves the purpose, though. We had a wooden one, but it rotted away. I haven't bought a new one. Nice clear beer. Just a slightly, slight malty aroma. Extremely light. I've had this beer before. I remember liking it. It's a lighter, lighter style lager. It's a Jamaican lager beer. It's got a nice flavor to the head. Very light flavor, but nice. I'm so happy that we got this nice weather. Can't wait for more of it. In a couple, uh, I work another week and then I have a week off from work for spring break. I drive a school bus. So I'll have time to make lots of videos. Let's hope for nice weather. Cheers, everybody. This is a nice laid back beer for a nice day. More brewed for summertime drinking. Nice, relaxing, mellow, easy going. Lawnmower beer. Uh, I didn't write down what I paid for this. It's not expensive. It's like two ninety nine, I think. Could have been a little more, but not outrageous. Maybe it was three forty nine, somewhere in there. This is a twenty four ounce bottle. Enjoyable beer. Nothing real exciting. A little bit of malty sweetness. Uh, sweetness overall is about another one that's about two and a half sugar cubes out of five. 
not real sweet, but it has a little bit of sweetness. Bitterness. Well, according to Untapped, it had, what did I say, 22 IBUs, 23 IBUs. And the taste doesn't seem like 23. It seems lower, like 15. Could be 23, though. Oh, such a nice day. I wish every day could be like this. The trees are just starting to get their green buds. The forsythias are getting the yellow flowers. The daffodils are up. My favorite time of the year. Well, anyway, this beer here. It's somewhere between a B plus and an A minus. I mean, it's a nice, mellow, easygoing beer. Very enjoyable. We'll go with a 90 out of 100. A minus. I think that's about the right score for this. <laughs> Buddy, what are you barking at? What are you barking at? My 13-year-old buddy's out here barking, and he's going to cook. The other one's going to come out, too, shadow. All right, well, I appreciate everybody watching. I hope your day is going as good as mine. Find yourself a good beer and drink it, whatever it is. Cheers, everybody. Bye-bye.